Before Reaganomics, we had rich, middle class, and poor. Now we have rich, poor, and poorer. You are poor. This documentary series is me and my friend Todd riding on Indian motorcycles from New York City to California. That long. Take two. I'm making this series because I'm sick and tired of people pissing on America. We want to figure out if the American dream still exists. If it does exist, where? For who for who for it? It's great to have this opportunity to ride a motorcycle from New York City to LA. But you know, along the way, it's all about meeting the people. You can roll them in here. Love it. <laughs> Our plan has been to, to reach out on social media to, to find people we're going to stay with as we go to East Town. We would love to host you in Renville, Ohio. Earthship Biotech job. Dude Ranch. <laughs> Dude Ranch! <laughs> You've been very kind to put us up. How can we pay our way? Well, you're both in good shape, so you get split wood. This was my dream since I was a kid. And you, and you feel like you realized it? Is I'm living my dream. So this whole adventure for me has been about I'm trying to put a spotlight on what's really good in America. You're gonna get to help build an Indian? No way! Two, three. Watch, 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 watch. What I like about Todd and James is you can tell that they are passionate about this journey that they're on. Our country needs more people who can look up from their phone and just smile and say hello to people. Good luck today in the rain, Thank you. Good luck. So there's lightning, thunder, serious amounts of rain. I just didn't expect it. I'd be this cold, this wet, this windy. Like now I feel like such an idiot. There's nothing fun about this right now. I mean, if you would have stopped, I would have stopped. I just thought it was like a like motorcyclist do it. No, know? they don't do it. But when I moved here and I met Giselle, I mean, it was like things start looking up. She was like my guardian angel. It was a beautiful moment because, it, it, you know, I saw Cheyenne say exactly how she felt, straight from the heart about Giselle. People lose their jobs and all these bad things happen, but they don't realize that at the end of all of that, things get better, that there's a new rainbow. We got enough negative stuff. You can't achieve your American dream. It just takes that extra bit of risk. My dream is to help others have a dream and then help them achieve that dream. I'm still dreaming. What is the American dream? Maybe, maybe you should tell me what it is. <laughs> <laughs>